Chiefs of police are gathering over the next few days for the annual Chiefs Conference. News 10's Mark Rigsby spoke to a chief from Acadiana about several topics on the agenda, but all of them have concerns over the increase in the price of gas and how they're going to pay for it. There were many topics of discussion among these police chiefs in Louisiana. One of the biggest, the rising price of fuel and how that will impact police budgets. I don't think anybody at this point knows how long these high prices are going to last for fuel, but it is something that I think we're all looking at. The police chiefs from Acadiana I spoke with say they may have to make some adjustments to their budgets if gasoline prices continue to soar. Be assured that um, we're not going to have less officers on the road, uh, even if it means putting a two man, you know, two officers per vehicle. Uh, that's what it takes, and that, that's what we're going to do to make sure that our community stays safe. We're not going to slow down on the patrolling. We're not going to slow down on, on the, in parked cars. Uh, we're going to continue to do our job. Police officers fill up at the gas station and pay the same price, just like you and me. And police vehicles are usually V6 or V8 engines, hardly fuel efficient. If fuel costs continue to increase and we go over budget or we're going close to over budget or something like you said we cannot control, uh, approaching city council with asking for an amendment of the budget will we'll not be hesitated on. But one thing they all told me was that they will not cut back on protecting the public. We're going to have to look at some innovative ways of trying to make sure that uh, we get out in the community and we continue to patrol and that will not stop and we're going to continue keeping our services. At the Louisiana Police Chiefs Conference in Kinder, Mark Rigsby, KLFY News 10.